What's up everybody, this is Yoko, as I'm known, <coughs> on YouTube, <coughs> excuse me, well, I just wanted to, well, I, I was going to do this with webcam, but um, it takes tremendous amounts of time to do some, um, what do you call it, rendering with a webcam and all that, but let's not get into that, come to kind of talk about you know my history and fiesta and kind of where I've been throughout the years I've been playing this game since oh, we're just gonna run through I want to show you a little bit of Euro if you haven't played Yoruga I mean and, and stuff um, I want to show you well I'm gonna kind of talk to you about how you know what I've done through my years in fiesta I've played since late um, what is it around 20 2010 late 2010 somewhere in there levels that retard now uh, <laughs> um, Okay, so we're gonna head to Yuru um, Mainly, you know I've, With this character here. This is the one that I've used it's got actually the most views on YouTube for me was with this character here. Um, if, if anybody's wondering, I'm also Castiel. This they're the same characters. I had a name change a while back, and I recently got one for free a couple months ago when when I came back to the game and um, I, I rechanged it back to Dayman Thirty Eight. Uh, I, I loved the name Castiel, but I always regretted changing his name. You know, because. Dayman38 was my name, the very first name I had here. So if, you, if any of you watching this hasn't actually played in a long time, yeah, Yuru is dead. This is about the entire game, honestly. Elderin had quite a few people in it, but there's nobody in AR either. So, um, you know, kind of my history on here. You know, when I first started playing, I met uh, uh, this one guild, the first guild I was in. They were like, uh, I, they were uh, two people that were married in real life, and they kind of showed me the game. You know, when I met these people, I didn't even know how to use a, a healing stone or anything. You know, it's it some pretty fun times back then that's when the game was at its prime I believe and you know I met well when they initially quit the two couple and um I found this guild love doctors and I joined this guild and you know to this day I still talk to a lot of the people that were in love doctors the original people I mean, they're some of my best friends I've ever met uh, really nice people we had some issues, and I, I really didn't get along. Well, when we were in guild together, I never really got along. Always something came up, and I would be, you know, mainly that was because I was younger. Um, and I guess I was a little bit of an ass back then, really, if you ask me. And uh, since then, I've done some growing up, but I, I left their guild because, you know, we didn't get along, but we still talk. You know, a lot of us talk in Skype all the time. Uh, it's, it made really good friends and love doctors, and I loved it there. Uh, I like the people. We play different games together now, and, and quite a bit of other stuff. You know, and it's kind of it's kind of crazy to think that. You know, but we're just gonna run, I guess. Just run to wherever. Actually, we can go to Barra. That'd be pretty cool. But yeah, you know, throughout my years after I left, uh, well, when I initially left Love Doctors, I was level 100, and back then, I, I was just, shit, I went the wrong way. I, I left the game uh, for quite a while, uh, about a year, actually, when I left the game then, and, um, yeah, when I came back, uh, I joined for a couple months again and left again for the same issues. But you know, I, I went and joined Hawkwind. And this one of my most viewed videos is my LN video, and and on you can see on the intro there, 
uh, it says Hawkwind with a bunch of hearts and and that's that's where I stayed for the longest time so I played that yeah, I stayed in that guild for a long time and um, throughout my time there I eventually left it and and when I left it initially I was level 108 or something and when I left I don't know one day I was really pissed off or I guess just emo and I deleted my character I deleted Dayman38 and the funny thing is uh, right after I did it I felt really bad about it I felt like I was a retard so I was like fuck what did I do that for so I messaged Outspark at the time and I was like you look uh, I accidentally deleted my character you know and blah 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 and they said one chance you got one chance if you do this again we're not restoring it so they actually restored the character and they said only one time you could do that so I, I don't know you know I, I'm willing to bet they do it more as long as you're spending money probably but yeah um after that uh, some more stuff happened I got perm banned uh, and that was fucking terrible oh my god I got gifted from some guy he gifted me about fifty dollars worth of stuff, I think it was, and uh, he canceled the payment on his credit card. So what wound up happening was I got banned too, and and actually my Wiz, uh, as you can see if you've seen any of my videos too, I have a 120 Wiz. Why don't, yeah, yeah, I've had a video of that. Um, and he got banned, but he was lower level at the time. He was like seventy or something. Um. And, and I, I was perm banned. So until Gamma Go came and took over, um, you know, the first few days that they took over, uh, they were they unbanned everybody. I think it was some issue with them transferring their server data over or something. Uh, and when I got on that day, and, and I basically gave everything away. I thought that was it. I was like, this is the last time I'll get to play on this count. So fuck it. Yeah, I got people to send me unbinds. I had a full SL set that was plus nine at the time, and an LH axe that was plus ten, and I gave all that stuff away. Well, a couple of days later, my friend Testo he messaged me on Facebook, and he's like, "Oh, hey, dude, people are getting unbanned. You know, uh, you should try and send in a ticket about your account." And I was like, hmm, "I guess I'll give it a go." So I did, and they unbanned me, and here I was with this account had nothing on it was pretty funny uh, at the time because I was like fuck I, I gave everything away because I thought I wasn't going to get to play this again so I got the account back and eventually over time I got my stuff back and I made it to like 111 ish around in there when I decided to finally quit again and quit for another it was a long time uh, I was just was burnt out you know what it takes to get to 111 or what it used to take you know was pretty extreme there was no LN past 105 um, so you basically had to grind nobody wanted you in the party everybody wanted to hoard their EXP which is kinda how this game set up you know uh, it's understandable so I, I, print, or I grinded from like 108 to 110 in fucking Adelia somewhere um, on those big ass liches I think it was it's pretty terrible uh, it, it sucked quite a bit um, but after that you know I was, I was burnt out oh, I was fucking broke from playing this goddamn game because it takes so much money you know it was just uh, extreme amounts of money you have to put into this and time too and just recently about August of last year I think it was around in there I came back and I had my whiz at about 101 and for some reason I, I didn't want to play the client anymore it, I just hated the thought of doing the DN repeat which was uh, the 111 to 115 repeat and I was like fuck I, don't, I, I just don't want to play the glad anymore I'll get the whiz to 110 and then I'll probably quit so wound up I got into this huge I don't know I got into this huge motivation time you know where I just like kept going and kept going and before I know it I was 120 
And I was thinking at that time, you know, I hit 120, what the hell? I, I still want to play this game, but I have no desire to go to 125. So I was like, fuck it, I'll play the Glad. So I played the Glad, and I got him to 115, and it's a pretty amazing time. You know, I actually made it, and, uh, and I'm happy. I'm happier because I thought, you know, this is something I would never do in Fiesta. Now I have two characters. One's 120 and one's 115. I also have a, uh, an, SS, an SS that is 103, but I, I, I'm not playing him anymore. You know, and it, it's kind of weird. Because I look back on when I, when I first quit this game, I thought to myself I'd never, ever play this shit again. It, and here it is five years later, or four you know, when I'm still playing this. Yeah, I'm, I'm making this video because, you know, the server merge is coming up and it's like a, it's a big deal. It's a pretty big deal and a lot of people are worried because, quite frankly, I don't think Gamago really even gives a fuck about their community, if you ask me. If they did, they would focus on the issue of why people left in the first place instead of having to just focus on a server merge. But that's their last thing thinking. They they don't even acknowledge the fact that the enhancement rate's so so fucking terrible. That that's half the reason why people don't want to play. You know, I have a full 115 set, a DDF set that I have that's plus zero that I, I will never use. I'm using this shitty ass gear because I'm not I'm not enhancing. Uh, it would take me two hundred dollars literally to enhance that fucking set. And I'm not doing it. I won't do it. And I, and I think I'm done again. You know, I haven't played in a couple of weeks here since I had 115. There's really no motivation to go on anymore. I'm, 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 I'm tired of putting money into this game. I love this game. And I have no, no big problem with putting money into a game, you know. But this amount of money is just fucking bullshit. It's frankly not even... You, you know, you could buy a car with some of the money that people have spent on this fucking game. You know, just in a matter of months, not including their whole time here. I could imagine the massive amount that some people have spent. And that's the only people left, really, in Epith anyway. This is the oldest people that have spent, you know, countless amounts of dollars into this shit. And it's just, it's something else. So... I'll kind of show off my stats, I guess, before we end this video. Um, it, it's, it, I got, I'm using an MQ Axe I just recently picked up. It took me for freaking ever to find, by the way. It's pretty crazy. <laughs> I just kind of wanted to talk about my history and Fiesta and, you know, I, and I'm going to miss this game. And I hope Gamago tries to take some action into rethinking, you know, why people don't want to play this shit anymore. Uh, but I'm afraid they're too money hungry to even consider that. So, we'll see. It's either that or this game's gonna die. Which I'm highly, you know, that's what it's looking like, pretty much. The server merge is just a band-aid. It's not gonna help, for my opinion. So, uh, thanks for watching, guys. Uh, I'll see you guys later, hopefully. Hopefully, one day I'll get back into this. So, see you guys.